Welcome to DWBI Adda channel. Please subscribe for latest training videos. Hello and welcome to the session on data frames using PySpark. In this session, we would like to understand how to filter the records in a data frame based on the records data from another data frame. Okay. So to do that, I would like to first begin with installing all the necessary packages. I import PySpark, I import FindSpark. Okay. And then I create the conf object for it with the set master is equal to local for it. I pass the conf object in the Spark context and I create the SC object and then the Spark session. I need to create the SQL context object in this as I'm de I'll be dealing with the data frames. Right? So I have two data frames over here. One is DF underscore ratings. That's the name of the data frame I provided. After I read the CSV files, which is about the movie ratings. After I do a df ratings dot show, it gives me four columns: user ID, movie ID, rating, and the date. So it's about the rating given by a user for a particular movie in a particular date. Okay. I have another data frame uh, which is about the premium uh, movies. So I have three movies listed over here. It can be more than that as well. So I just import the CSV file and I create another data frame called df underscore premium. Right. Now the requirement over here is I would like to filter the premium movies and get the ratings of different users from DF ratings. Okay. The premium movies are listed in the data frame DF underscore premium and I'm supposed to perform a lookup in it. Okay. So now to do that, I can do it in many methods. I'll be talking about two of the methods over here. The first one I'll be talking about is to make the list of the movie IDs present in the DF underscore premium. Okay. So to do that, I would run a flat map, which will run through all the records in the data frame df underscore premium and extract the movie IDs out of it and make a list. If I print the pre prm underscore mv underscore list, it gives me the list of the movie IDs. Okay. And now I will take the same list and I'll try to filter it from my original df underscore ratings movie. So I do a df underscore ratings dot filter okay. and I give the condition where call move id is in prm movie list which is nothing but the list I have created based on the data from the other table. Once I do a show of it, I would give, it would throw me only the movie ids which is present in the premium database, data, uh, data frame and list it in the as a data frame again. Okay. The second method is quite simple. Okay. So instead of doing all these things and instead of going for the double step over uh, as we did in the first method, I would simply do an inner join. Okay. So to do that, it's just like an inner join which we perform in the RDBMS tables. Okay. So I'll do a join and I provide the name of the data frame. It is df underscore premium. And I give the column on which it wants to join and the type of join over here it will be inner because I want only the common columns. Okay. But the thing is, it will give me an additional column, the movie name as well, which can be a good information and might be sometimes headache if you don't want it. If you don't want it, you can just drop this column and that would be the original four columns from the original data frame. If I compare these two, they are exactly the same. So these are just two different ways to do it. There's actually many ways, but we just covered a couple of them over here. And finally, I should not forget to stop this Spark context job over here. Thank you.